My name is Silas, I'm the Global Distribution and OEM Sales Manager here at Deity, and this is my bike. So this year I'm riding the 2021 Stump Jumper Evo. Uh, I love this bike for a couple of reasons. One, we work with Specialized pretty closely on the OEM side of our business. They're one of two partners that we work with for OEM. So that's why you'll see on some of the top of the line Specialized bikes, they come with our Copperhead stem and also some of our grips. I've also chosen this bike because of some of the features they built into this bike. They made an adjustable head tube angle that's independent of your bottom bracket height. It's nice to be able to adjust those independently. I dig it. I also love the SWAT box on these bikes. I know it's kind of one of those cliche, silly things, but I love not having to put on a pack when I go ride. I've got a windbreaker stuffed in there, all my tools, a tube. It's amazing. I've got a pretty traditional build kit on this bike. Uh, you know, SRAM drivetrain with Fox suspension. DT wheels are kind of my go-to. I love DT wheels. I love aluminum wheels. They just seem to have the good balance between compliance and durability. So I dig those wheels. I run Max's tires. I've run them for years. I love their tires. Fox suspension, front and back. I put an extra volume spacer in the rear. Nobody cares about that. Outside of that, it's a pretty, pretty straightforward build kit. I went with the reverb axis dropper post, which uh, is kind of nice. Just one less cable hanging off the handlebars. Uh, I'm running the Brendog handlebars, which most of our handlebars come in a 25 or a 38 millimeter rise, so I, I like that these are 30 mil rise, kind of right in the middle there. I also like that they have a little bit less back sweep at eight degrees, so it gives gives you an option there. This bike comes with a 38.6 seat clamp, so we've just gotten these seat clamps into stock. I run the lockjaw grips. Uh, I've gone back and forth between the lockjaw and the super cush grips, but right now I'm running the lockjaw. Just love how they feel in the palm of your hand. They've got that half waffle on the underside, which I personally like that your fingertips just kind of grip into that half waffle. I've got a 35 millimeter copperhead stem on this bike to get the reach where I want it. I run Shimano clipless pedals typically. I bounce between those and our Def Trap pedals, but right now I've got my Shimano pedals on there. I've got a wide open fender on the front of this. It's a Marsh Guard fender, but it's from our distributor Wide Open out in New Zealand. Love those guys, so got to run their kit. So that's a quick preview of my bike. If you wanna get your hands on any of the parts, we'll drop links in the description down below to everything I run on my bike. Be sure to check us out, ddcomponents.com. Hit us up on Instagram if you're not already following us. See you at the next one. Peace. <laughs>